It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. Okay, we're gonna make up a frame for our bees to hold the shelf because it's collapsed with the weight of the hub and honey, it was that heavy. So I've got to do the bee boxes, which I'll film as well, but we just got some timber that we got left over from jobs. So always be a bit of a hoarder, not too much, otherwise your friends will get upset with you. Um, so our measurements today are gonna to be guesstimation, or well, not really, it's 1600 by 600. So we need two lengths at 1600 and two at 1600 millimeter. So that's 16 centimeters, 160 centimeters and 60 centimeters. So we'll give it a go measure up in that. Got a square tape measure, handy pencil. I'm going to use screws to put it together. So the best thing with always with um, timber, if you can, is pilot holes before you screw in. Otherwise, you'll split your timber and it won't be doing what um, you want it to do to last the job. Also too, we won't be painting this because it'll be underneath the tin and it'll be out from the weather. But if you are gonna be in the weather, make sure you prime it and paint it if you want it to last. Okay, being a beekeeper, we do what we need to do, no more. All right, here we go. So let's see what we got here. I believe this one here is 1200, which it is. So we're gonna mark it at 600, which is there. An old square and draw them off. And this one here we want 1600 each. That's got a bad end at that end. So we'll just flip them around like this. Straightforward. So line him up. We don't have to be perfect here because it's just a frame to go underneath the tin. It's a pilot hole. That's it. We might just put one in first, I think, to hold it into place. Be fine. Go in there, back it up again. Just hold it there for tick. Do another pilot hole, make sure he's reasonably square. Another screw.
remember your eye protection, as I always wear. Always be safe. And there we go. What's going to happen?
Okay, what an absolute duff moment that was. Um, not thinking, too much weight. I can't believe how much stores are getting. There must be still a flow on somewhere because it's really heavy than boxes. So, um, top ones are empty. They're the ones that I want to clean up from the harvest, if you remember. But all this bottom one, they've got heaps of weight in there, so they're getting uh, nectar from somewhere. So we may sneak in another harvest, I'm not sure. But we'll see how they go after a couple of days. They're pretty pissed at the moment. So if you want to piss your bees off, do what I did. Have a duff moment. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys.